back to that dad guy. It's April the 24th, 2022, and I've got a bunch of postcards that I'm going to write today. I've got them all picked out already. I've got six official ones I can send, and I've got another 14 or 15 uh, swaps and friends mail that I'm going to attempt to write out. Um, so wish me luck, but I'll show you what I've picked out today, and uh, we'll go from there. But thank you so much for liking, subscribing, and commenting. And uh, for those of you who are still thinking about the Ukraine stamps, still looking for more, I have some for this week. I'm going to be putting out a video, so that's great. But if you want to continue to contribute, if you have my address already, that's great. Just uh, send them on. And if you haven't, send me an email at robertlennox at gmail.com. And I'll provide you with an address where you can send those Ukrainian stamps so I can show them off to you guys, put them in the album, and present them to my father. His birthday actually is coming up in the next couple of weeks. So it would be nice to have that uh, put together for him then. I'm not sure if it will be done in time for that. But... Uh, we might uh, show them the progress where we're at. So appreciate that. Just wanted a quick plug on that as we went on. So let's get to today's post crossing. And uh, my first one is going to, uh, to it's going to Milwaukee. So in the United States, this person, no, not is going to Milwaukee, but it's going to Oregon, Milwaukee, Oregon. Uh, so it wasn't the one I was thinking of in Wisconsin. Uh, they love to travel. She uh, loves seeing post-crossing stamps. I don't have any of those, unfortunately. And uh, loves getting postcards of elephants, especially baby ones. Vintage, pinups, LGBTQ, uh, Lou Paper, Cherry Blossoms, Lego. That was the one that was like, ding, 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 Lego, maybe. Blueberries, photography, swimming, tattoos, um, Vintage advertisement, Wonder Woman, uh, meetup cards, maxi cards, all those fun things. So I had a whole bunch of ones I had to uh, go through that I could choose from. And, uh, you know, anytime someone says they like Lego, I like to provide it. But I went in a different direction. She liked vintage advertisements. She likes pinups. I had this vintage advertisement for bathing suits uh, with uh, some beautiful women on it. and uh, So I thought maybe this would be something she'd be interested in. So that's the one I chose for her. Hopefully it's the right decision. If not, next time it's going to be Lego. All right. So the next one is going to Germany. And I have to be uh, honest, all the uh, countries that came of the six, I'm very happy with them. And uh, so I think they should all reach their destinations, which is really good. So this one's going to Germany. And uh, she loves traveling, traveling, visiting lots of different places around the world. She'd love to travel to all five continents in her lifetime. Big fan of Peanuts, they're the Snoopy characters. Uh, also likes Christmas cards at Christmas time and post-crossing meetup cards. Uh, she's a huge fan of puffins, dogs, beautiful snaps, and likes to read and enjoy good books. All right, so I kind of stopped there. When she said puffins... Uh, we've got puffin cards and dogs. So anyways, I chose this card of Newfoundland. So we have the puffins. We have a Newfoundland dog there, a moose and the whales and the icebergs. So uh, I thought this was great. And I can put some stamps on it. There's information about it on the back. So that one is going off to Germany. Uh, I have, the next one is going to Finland. And she enjoys uh, knitting and collecting first aid covers loves to cook and bake and uh, she loves to eat as well <laughs> who doesn't enjoy eating i'm a huge uh, consumer of all kinds of sports loves hockey and football which i presume she means soccer there uh, i am one of the happy citizens of the small cozy friendly city in southern finland and she should rate whatever you like and facts about your hometown. I know there's not enough space on postcards, but just say hello. Uh, it's all great. And she loves tourist cards. So I've chosen this one about a moose because it has all sorts of facts already on it. So it's going to maximize what it can do. It's a big card. And on the back, there's lots of empty space. So I can get her address in there. I can put some uh, stickers and stamps on that she likes. And uh, still write a bit about what's going on down east here. All right, the next one's going to Indonesia. This is my first card going off to Indonesia. Uh, so it's nice to get a new country to select. Uh, she likes all sorts of things like Disney and Harry Potter and uh, cute illustrations. She loves uh, Korean dramas, Harry Potter movies, traveling, favorite places to go or near beaches, loves tea and chocolate, collecting cute stationery, loves to learn foreign languages. 
someone is in the bathroom upstairs now. So I'm getting water, <laughs> not, not water coming through, but you're hearing it, you're going through the pipes. So I can either stop the video and start again, or I can just go on through. So I'm gonna go on through and see how it goes. But anyways, I chose this card. So we have the rocks down by the beach. You have the lighthouses, the waterfront. You've got uh, the Confederation Bridge here, and um, you've got our covered bridges as well. So I have sent this one out recently, and uh, people really seem to enjoy this one. So uh, hopefully going to Indonesia, they will really enjoy it as well. This is what happens when life goes on around you, is that, uh, yeah, you're continuing to make videos, but when you have a house with two teenagers and uh, two adults, sometimes people end up having showers and things in the middle of your videos. The next one is going to the Czech Republic. And she says they prefer uh, city views, landscapes, sites of your city and country, animals, especially cats and horses, baby animals, wild animals, movie posters, uh, travel, world postcards, and a blue cat, but happy with whatever he sends. Uh, when they said they like city views and landscapes and sites from your city, this extended postcard of the city at night, um, the last one I actually have of this one, I'm going to have to go back to the museum and collect some more postcards from them because these seem to be very popular postcards, not not just this scene alone, but the ones that I've been getting from the post or from the museum, excuse me. Um, people seem to like them. So that one of the city is going to go out to the Czech Republic. The next one is going to South Carolina in the United States. And uh, also enjoys crafting and sewing and crocheting, stamping, collecting Christmas stamps, writing letters and books, music, dancing, travel, sightseeing, old movies, and most of all, good food. So it goes on and talks about all the other different things in here. I love when they give lots of details. When she talked about loving old movies, I thought what better than uh, Roman Holiday by Audrey Hepburn. It's kind of a, it's an older movie, of course. It's got that vintage look to it with the yellowing paper. Uh, so hopefully she will like that. So those are the six that I have that are outgoing official ones. Now let's get to friend swaps and... Um, new ones that are coming out here of course we're going to send out a that dad guy postcard always seems to be one person either that uh is kind of perfect for that postcard maybe is a, a new person or someone who has been watching the channel and has reached out so uh, they all seem to like them when they get them um, at least that's what they're telling me uh, maybe they're going right in the garbage as soon as they get them i don't know but anyways that one's going to go out this one here, I, which I absolutely love, um, This I got this recently, and uh, I got a bunch of them actually, because I love them. So it's got the mail truck for Canada Post, and the happy post crossing, and the uh, beautiful borders here for the old air mail uh, envelopes. So that one is going to go out. We have this one here of a nice Yorkshire tea. The card actually came from Jilly B. Um, she got it at a, a shop along the way, so I cleaned up all the stickers and things off of it. But it's a nice scene, and lots of people enjoy tea. And uh, who doesn't enjoy a nice uh, Yorkshire pudding, if it happens to go along? Now, you wouldn't normally have a Yorkshire pudding with a, a cup of tea. I realize that it's going to come with your roast beef dinner. but uh, And Yorkshire tea doesn't necessarily mean you're going to have a Yorkshire pudding. Regional. I get it. Just making it funny. All right. This one here of uh, the moose in Canada. It's going to head out and uh, just kind of a, a nice scene, but I think it's going to go to someone who has probably not encountered a moose, at least not in their area. And then this one, be the reason someone smiles today with the uh, fake Canadian stamps up there, cute kids just playing along, and, and once again, the nice border. Love those cards, so we're going to send that out. It's kind of nice when you see a uh, postcard haul that I put out and then the next post crossing day, a lot of those cards are heading back out again. They don't stay around very long in my collection. I like them so much that I want to share them and send them around. Like this one here, keep calm and enjoy chocolate. It's got to go out and it's going to the right person. So uh, yeah, they're going to enjoy it when they get it. How about this one, Doctor Strange. I don't know how many of you uh, watch the movies or have read the cartoons. Um, Benedict Cumberbatch, uh, the actor, plays Doctor Strange in the most recent movies. And uh, so this old comic book cover is going to go to somebody. 
This one here, two beautiful birds, nice scene. Um, just a bit of nature. And everybody can appreciate a little bit of nature from time to time. It doesn't always have to be mechanical beauty. Um, beauty comes in all different forms and it's nice to appreciate what's here. Keep calm. It's tea time. Many of you out there drink tea. I'm not one of them, but uh, many of you do. And uh, some of you may appreciate a nice cup and saucer and a beverage within. How about this one here? Minerva's head, Roman. So a bit of artwork, try to get the glare off there for you. So that one's gonna go off to someone who enjoys history. Keep calm and draw on. Many of you who watch and have sent things are super creative and I really love that. Um, I've been happy to uh, be a beneficiary of some of your creativity. There's one of them right there. Love the uh, fan art for Polo in the mug that uh, came from Samantha in the United States. So that's going to be on display. I may even frame that one and put it up. And who knows, if more of them start showing up, maybe I'll put up a little wall of uh, artwork that uh, gets sent in. Anything is possible. The next one. I know it's not World Postcard Day. It's not till October, but the image, the card are perfect. And uh, it's got to go and uh, spread the joy and love somewhere else. So that one's going out. This image of the rocks in 1905, um, you could take that today with a black and white shot and have a very similar image. Um, the rock formations do change with the tides when they come in, but uh, just a beautiful place to walk along the beach floor when the tide is out. Keep calm and check the mailbox for all of you out there who love mailboxes and all the different ones that are around. This is a very typical scene as a mailman to be able to go by and see a, a bank of mailboxes all together. So that one's going to go out. It makes me happy. And here is another one of those ones that are, are from the museum. So this is Main Street in Moncton in 1912, the Old West type scene. Even though it's the East, so it's the Old East type scene. And just a little bit of local history here sending out. So that's my job, that's my task ahead of me, is to fill all those out, stamp them, get them in the mail for tomorrow. Um, next week, back to full five day work week. So every day there'll be some mail. So hopefully I will start off uh, the post office with a big chunk of postcards that are going out to new homes and uh, enjoy my Sunday. I've got some grocery shopping to do today. Uh, my son's going off to uh, the school to work out of the gym and do some basketball. Um, my daughter's off to practice for something she has coming up for a grad event for high school as well. So that's going on. And uh, yeah, there's always things to do. It's fun. It's the weekend. And uh, we'll relax a little bit with a little post crossing here. So I'm not going to come back on and walk out to the mailbox with you today because I think I'm going to take these cards into work with me tomorrow morning and mail them there. So I will say happy post crossing to you guys. Uh, enjoy the, what's left of your weekend and uh, whatever you have coming up for next week. Get ready to see some things show up in your mailboxes. Stay safe. What, Polo? You say like, subscribe, share, and tell all your friends. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy?